like you ever felt. Are you listening? that I just got today. So let's get started. So I have seen a lot of things from Fashion Nova and I've checked their website a couple times but I haven't really actually looked through it. I found a couple things that I thought I would order and I'm kind of excited and curious as to how their stuff is because I've seen a lot of people talk about it but I never actually really gave them a chance. And came in this regular priority mail thing, which I was kind of upset for because there's some websites that, that sent some pretty cute packaging, so kind of sad about this one. Oh, everything is filling out. And enjoy 20% off. It's pretty cool. Hopefully I really like this so I can order some more stuff. I got two different things. Um, one is a set and the other is a romper. Yeah, there's a romper. So I'm gonna open this one first. This is very, very, very wrinkled. There's a bunch of stuff in here. What the hell? How is this? Oh my god, it is super see-through, first of all. So I'm gonna have to make sure you go wear some black underwear. It literally just looks like fabric. There's like yarn or string coming out of it. So hopefully it lasts me a while. Oh, Bubba, I'm so sorry. I scared my cat. The phone's on vibrating and it's sleeping on this thing. Okay, so here we have the bottom part, which is the shorts. And then this kind of just goes on top. And I will try this on so you guys can see what it looks like. So like I said, there's the bottom part. Excuse the wrinkleness. I would have ironed this if I had time, but I don't. And here are the two parts, two thin parts that strap around your neck and go around your waist and tie around. That's cute. I really like the pattern though. That's why I got it, so it can match my hair and everything. The second thing I got was this set in black. So again, we have very thin fabric. It's just a crop top with some stripes on the side of the sleeves. And my voice, sorry, my voice is going away because of this weather. It's hot and then it's like cold when I go out into the living room and I'm just dying everywhere. The bottoms are just, uh, I believe, high-waisted because they look pretty long. And they have white stripes on the sides as well. In a way, I'm glad it's thin fabric because it's really hot in California right now. I don't want to be dying. <laughs> so that was from Fashion Nova. And the next thing I have is... Arctic Fox hair dye. I was curious about them because I watched Kristen Lan on YouTube and I love her. She is also the founder of Arctic Fox, which is a vegan hair dyeing company. So the cool thing about these hair dyes is that they smell good, the colors are super vibrant, and it's also cruelty free, which is really cool. You can leave it on your hair for as long as you want. It recommends 30 minutes, but I normally do an hour just because I'm so used to already doing it that much. These are the colors I ordered before. It's aquamarine and iris green. I had a ombre effect of it. I had aqua at the very top, and then I had it go down to iris green. It looked pretty cool. Now since I'm like towards the end of these bottles, I'm just mixing them together and putting it in my hair. And so this is kind of what it looks like right now. It's faded a little bit, but the color is still in there, so they're pretty good about that. So what I'm dyeing my hair color next is hopefully a coral peachy color, which is why I ordered virgin pink and sunset orange. I'm gonna mix these two together and dilute them a little bit, and we'll see how my hair turns out in a couple of weeks. The next thing I wanna talk about is these vibration backpacks. Look at how shiny that is. So I got this one in Vegas because the one that I had ordered online had not been there in time for EDC. So I met up with one of the workers there. She said she was going to be in Vegas and she was going to have some if I wanted to go buy another one and just return the other one. So I bought this one. It's pretty big. It has a small pocket, 
this long pocket and another pocket in here. So you can fit a lot of things in here. It's also two liters little bladder that it has in here with the mouthpiece and everything. So I really like this one. I didn't want this color, but I really grew to love it. And here is the package that I received the day after I left for Vegas. This is the one that I had ordered. It's a blue one and it's also holographic just like the other one. I don't want to take it out because I'm not sure if I'm going to return this one yet. Just because I have the other one. But I really like them so who knows, I might end up keeping it. It's the same thing, two liter, three pockets. Very cool. I also recommend these if you're looking for a hydration pack with a more of a design or something. They have different types of patterns and colors and whatnot. I didn't want to get just a plain black one from Walmart so I paid a little bit more for these but it was definitely worth it for me so check them out if you are going to a festival or something because it gets very hot out there and you don't want to be dehydrated. I'm going to dehydrate right now because it is super hot and I don't have AC in here so <laughs> sorry if I look like a sweaty hot mess right now. Okay, I have two more places to show you. These I went in store and bought them of course. First place is Windsor and um, I was going to a Hawaiian themed party and I didn't have anything really Hawaiian even though I do have a lot of floral things they didn't really look Hawaiian to me and I wanted something new so I went into Windsor of course it is a long dress and it looks like this this is the front of it and the back of it crosses over a couple of times I don't know if you can see it but I will most likely show you right now a long dress with this pattern all the way going down. I love the pattern, the colors are very vibrant, matched my hair, and it was really cute. The next thing I got at Windsor was in their clearance section. It's just a plain black crop top and the back looks like this where you can show off your back a little bit. And what I really liked about this is that it's kind of very cropped up high so that you can see my tattoo, which is pretty cool. And you're probably looking at it right now. <laughs> if you don't know, those are the lyrics to the 1975 song Robbers, which is my all-time favorite song. And it means a lot to me, so I got that tattooed on me. Sorry mom again, if you're watching. So the next place I went to was Macy's in the shoe department because I always shop for clothes there and I never even bother to go upstairs because I work in the clothing section. I found these blue velvet high heels from Betsy Johnson. Suede or velvet? There's a difference. I know there is, but I can't think of it right now. This is suede. And look at the bottom of it. I've already used it, so pay no attention to that. But the back is a little light blue, and it has the heart with Betsy Johnson on it, and I fell in love with these and I got them. I don't know if you can tell I have an obsession for blue and green right now. I also went into the guest area because I love guests ever since I started working there and they have a lot of cute stuff. And I got this cropped sweater which says guests on it if you can see a little bit. It's in black of course so you can't really see it unless you're in the sun or something. I know it's warm nowadays but I needed something because even I get cold sometimes at night. I also went over to the men's department because I was looking for a gift. And I found myself a shirt in the boys section, of course. Frankie. <laughs> my cat is just laying all over my bag, so I wish I could show you guys right now. <laughs> okay, so it's just a Batman shirt that's bleached. I thought it was pretty cool. I initially was going to get it for my boyfriend, but he wasn't really into this bleach thing. So I got it for myself. And I really like it, so sorry if you hate that I'm wearing it. <laughs> so if you enjoyed this haul, make sure to like this video. I will be back soon. I have a few more things to film and I'm trying to get rid of stuff on my computer, which is why I haven't had any videos because I can't edit because there's no room on my computer whatsoever and it won't let me save or do anything. And yeah, that's it. I'll see you guys next time. Bye guys.